Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvanian toy collector himself. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we will be reviewing Transformers, Robots in Disguise, Sideswipe. And this is my second Robots in Disguise Sideswipe. And this is probably a neat figure I picked up from Still City Con. He is missing his weapon because this is a used figure. But if I ever get up to a certain amount of subscribers and I have people send me in weapons and figures I don't have, I would sure appreciate it in the future. But for now, I'm happy with having this figure without the sword or whatever weapon he had in Robots in Disguise. But he rolls very successfully for a Sideswipe figure. Now, for comparison, before we do Transformation. Here he is next to my original... Robots in Disguise, Three-Step Changer, Sideswipe, and of course, with his Generations counterpart. Different car for that comparison. And you're probably wondering, why don't I have many Sideswipes? Well, I haven't picked up much. I would love to get my hands on the... Universe Classics Sideswipe and maybe the G1 and possibly Transformers Cyber Battalion Sideswipe. But I only have three Sideswipes. I may extend into Kingdoms eventually. But now we're going to transform Robots in Disguise Sideswipe. First we're going to disconnect the arms like so. That'll loosen up the legs so you can transform them. Flip this up. Makes it easier to transform. Split the legs. That's part of the transformation for the legs. And now we're going to rotate this around. And straighten it out. And there we got one leg all done. Second verse, just like the first, we're going to rotate this joint around. Free up the foot. Rotate the leg like so. And there you got the lower body of our side swipe transformed. And now we're going to work on the upper body of side swipe. We're going to... Rotate these wheel sections into the body to form his Robots in Disguise body. Second verse, just like the first, rotate these rims and then connect them into the pegs, into the chest. And there we got Sideswipe in his robot mode. From Transformers Robots in Disguise. And this is a good looking sideswipe. Sure, he's got a little bit of loose s -s syndrome here. Loose joint syndrome. But otherwise, he's really well molded. Really well sculpted. I love it. You even get that Japan's... Japanese or Japan symbol on his chest, which is pretty cool. Let's see if I can get a close-up of that. Doesn't that look awesome on his chest? Man, it's just like he came right out of the Robots in Disguise cartoon. But now we're going to get down to articulation. Head is on a rotation joint. So you can get some wiggle wobbly movement out of the head, which is nice. And it's on a ball joint. So you get some wiggle wobbly movement with the head. That's nice. And his arms are on a ball joint. Nice. 
full rotation. Shoulders are on a hinge, which is really nice. I love all the hinge joints on this figure. Bend at the knee. Very nice. Ball jointed knee. And rotation at the thigh, which is nice. I will say for this old school Transformers figure from Robots in Disguise, this figure is pretty cool. It's probably my new favorite side swipe. And you're probably wondering, where did I get this side swipe from? Well, I got him from Steel City Con, I think for about five bucks. Is a Robots in Disguise side swipe worth adding to your Transformers collection? Yes, he is pretty cool. He could and he's pretty cool with the whole mohawk, robot mohawk. That's what I loved about Robots in Disguise Sideswipe the moment I saw the cartoon. That mohawk look. But now we're going to compare him and transform his other self from Robots in Disguise, the other version of Sideswipe. And they have the exact same mohawk. And they look adorable together if I do say so myself. This is going to be my number one Robots in Disguise Sideswipe. Because this is the better looking Sideswipe. Sure, he doesn't have his weapon. But otherwise, he's a good looking figure. Worth picking up. Finally, to add to my collection. But now, for comparison, we got another Robots in Disguise figure. Robots in Disguise, Skyward. I'm keeping that figure out for a Skywarp review comparison with the Universe Classics Skywarp. So, stay tuned for that little Legends Universe Classics Sky, Skywarp. And now, for the final comparison... We're going to compare Robots in Disguise Sideswipe with his Generation 1 inspired counterpart from Transformers Siege. And I love this figure a lot, so I've memorized the transformation hands down because I'm that good at memorizing my own figure's transformations. I am very good at transforming Transformers figures. It's my favorite thing to do on this channel. And we're probably going to have a bunch more figures on Christmas Eve. Stay tuned for when I do an epic Christmas Eve toy haul here on Eddie Hill Review. And definitely stay tuned for more Transformers and a Christmas special I will be doing here on Eddie Hill Review. But now, for that comparison. Here he is next to his Generation 1 counterpart. And they look good together. If I do say so myself. If you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And I am definitely going to try to pick up more Transformers, Robots in Disguise, because I just love that show. And this is Eddie Hill, moving on, and rock on, and rock out.